Hi YouTube, this is Felicia with Bible Scraps. And have you guys been able to hit up your local Hobby Lobby yet? Are your stores having that crazy 75% off Calarant craft sale? I know it's died down a bit, but I was at Hobby Lobby yesterday. I had some returns. And sometimes I like to just walk throughout the store, relax and chill. And somehow I ended up back where the frames are made and came across the section that has the Copics. And I looked inside the case and by the way, the Copics are locked up at Hobby Lobby. I think they used to be locked up at Michael's too, but now I think they're in the checkout aisle section. But anyway, I glanced in and saw that several markers were marked down to two dollars. Now I have no clue if this is part of that 75% off sale they're having throughout the store. I don't know but the regular price. Well you guys know Copics are expensive. They're the premier alcohol marker. I think they may have been the first to come out with alcohol markers and they're expensive especially this particular shape. The price at Hobby Lobby is eight dollars and they're expensive no matter where you buy them and I don't remember if the local craft stores still takes coupons on the Copic markers but anyway they were marked down to two dollars so I only picked up three now I do know every Hobby Lobby is different so your stores may not have these marked down yet they could be marked down at different prices some stores might have a lot of these marked down. I have no, but it could be that your store will never have these marked down because my local Hobby Lobby has yet to mark down the Tim Holtz Oxide inks. So I lucked out when I found a bunch at an out of town Hobby Lobby. Speaking of Hobby Lobby, <laughs> we are getting Hobby Lobby number two in my neck of the woods. Yay! So these are the colors I picked up. BG90 and E97 and FYG1. Now I have a small selection of Copics. I have more Spectrum Nor than anything. And I know Tuesday morning just had a great deal on a 24 pack for 20 bucks. But I did pick up these three because I don't have them. I will test these out. For the color oh this is a pretty color it's called deep orange i love that color copics colors are available in over 300 colors hobby lobby has maybe 75 to 100 available now this one is gray sky bg90 and with the copics you do get two tips this is um the barrel tip and then you have the brush tip now I was really excited about this fluorescent yellow FYG1 because I have the fluorescent colors by Spectrum Noir and I didn't realize I had a yellow <laughs> already so I'm going to compare these two together they look different on the tops but the caps are deceiving they don't always match up with the color in the marker okay so hmm, is that really fluorescent okay let's try spectrum nor let's try well this is the tip on the spectrum nor you know I'll open them both up you got your barrel and then you have this tip this is not I don't think a brush tip the Copic has the barrel and has this tip okay so let's try this oh they're definitely different colors well then again yeah it is it's darker when it's wet as a matter of fact uh okay spectrum nor has more green in it and the copic has more of a yellow color the Spectrum Nora looks more fluorescent to me. 
but I'm glad I picked up the Copic because the color is different. Now, both markers are refillable. You can buy the refills to fill both of these up. Okay, so I tested these and out. And while I have these two fluorescent markers out, I'll go ahead and test them out. Many of you probably never heard of the fluorescent alcohol marker. This one is FL2. Oh, wow, this one is drying out. I have not used this marker that much. Okay, yep, it's drying out. Okay, and this is the FL1. I do have refills for one of these. I'm not sure which one. But can you tell that these are fluorescent? The colors are pretty. Well, yeah, you guys, check your local Hobby Lobby if you are interested in this particular style marker. I've never gotten a Copic marker this style for $2. I mean, the price is unheard of. So while I'm talking about alcohol markers, let me just show you guys how a refill look for the Copic in case you have never seen one before. It looks like this and a refill for the Spectrum Nor marker. Well, it used to look like this. I purchased a lot of these last year or the year before and well, over half of my ink bottles were, they were halfway filled because the ink had evaporated. So I sent mine back and I know as of like a year ago, they were working on a new design, a new bottle. But this is how the older bottle looks. And this one has my fluorescent yellow. Oh, darn it. I thought it had one of these two colors. Darn it. I did pick up these colors, but I sent them back because, well, like I stated, half the ink had evaporated. Okay, so if you guys, if your stores have these markers on clearance, leave that information below. Also leave how much your store has the markers for and in how many colors. My store didn't have that many colors, but I picked up three from what was available. Alrighty, I wanna thank you all for watching. Have a wonderful day and as always, blessings.